Hello, hello, my beautiful crafters. Welcome to Dress My Craft. This is designer Jeshri this side. Today I'm going to be sharing a beautiful shabby chic MDF altered box using the very beautiful Peach Story paper pack from Dress My Craft. But before we begin, please do subscribe to the channel if you're new here and press the bell icon to stay updated with our latest videos. To begin with, here is the gorgeous paper pack Peach Story from the Dream Collection by Dress My Craft. There are 10 designs in this paper pack and 2 sheets per design. The cardstock is 12 by 12 in size and 240 GSM in weight. To begin with, I have here a 6.5 square box which I am going to alter. I am going to begin with adding a little bit of avocado color on the edges of the box. To make sure that the edges when visible behind the paper pack is not MDF but a light nice green color. Once done, I am taking the paper cut to size of the lid of the box as well as some fussy cut elements from the same designer paper and distressing it with the distress oxide in the color vintage photo. Next, I am using some metallic paints to add some stenciling on the pattern paper itself. some molds made out of clay that I will be using to embellish on top of my lid along with the paper fussy cutouts. I am using a couple of colors in brown and green to add color to my embellishments. Once done, I am using 4 strips of paper to be added on the 4 sides of the box. I am distressing these strips with the same vintage photo distress oxide ink again. Here I have used a glue to adhere my papers but you can always use decoupage glue or mod posh to adhere these papers as well. Once done, it's time to assemble the embellishments to form our beautiful composition on top of the lid. Since the part is self-explanatory, I'm going to put on some music for you to enjoy the composition. Also, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you're enjoying watching this tutorial and the list of all the products used from Dress My Craft is given in the description box below, so do check that out.
composition is done and adhered, I am using unicorn beads from Dress My Craft and adhering them in some places like in the frame and around the composition fussy cut out flowers to add more interest. Next, I am using the same avocado color and adding some splatters on the lid of the box. And here our box is done in no time. I hope you enjoyed watching this tutorial and are inspired to create your very own altered boxes and more. Please do give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already before you go. Until next time, happy crafting. Bye-bye.